Welcome to the Aria School. The largest countries in the world. Hello! What do you know about the largest countries in the world? Let's find out some interesting facts about the top 6 largest countries. Russia, Canada, the USA, China, Brazil, Australia. Number 1. Russia. Russia's 17.1 million square kilometers easily make it the world's largest by area. Russia borders 14 different countries. The taiga, the world's largest terrestrial biome, extends all the way from eastern Canada throughout the vast majority of northern Russia. Most of Russia is uninhabited. The territory of Russia is rich in various minerals, oil, gas, but so far they do not use by Russia sufficiently effectively. Number 2. Canada Canada's 9.984 million square kilometers make it the largest country in the Western Hemisphere. Eastern Canada is the traditional heart of the nation with Toronto, Montreal and the national capital of Ottawa, all located in the east. Canada's capital is Ottawa. Number 3. The United States of America The United States, just bigger than China but slightly smaller than Canada, occupies 9.83 million square kilometers. The capital of the United States is Washington. Number 4. China China occupies 9.6 million square kilometers. However, that figure is not including disputed territories. It shares a border with 14 different countries. With over 1.35 billion citizens, China is home to 56 recognized ethical groups, has the world's 18th largest Muslim population, the 19th largest Christian population, and with 1.9 doctors per 1,000 people. The capital of China is Beijing. Number 5. Brazil The largest country in South America at over 8.51 million square kilometers, Brazil plays home to much of the world's largest rainforest, the Amazon. The Amazon is so dense and vast that explorers and scientists have found human civilizations that had never made contact with the outside world. The capital of Brazil is the city of Brasilia. Number 6. Australia Australia is the largest country in ocean area so far. Technically, it is so large that it doesn't even qualify as an island. It is a continental landmass. The vast majority of its population live in the coastal cities like Sydney in the east and Perth in the west. And with good reason, the Australian outback is one of the world's driest and hottest regions. Along with extreme climate and geography, Australia is known for its spectacular and often deadly wildlife. The capital of Australia is Canberra. I hope you did find this topic useful. Now you can share it with your friends. I can't wait to see you in following episode. Stay tuned! Geometric shapes And right now we are going to learn geometric shapes that will be useful for you in future And here they are Cube Hexagonal prism Torus And this shape called sphere. The next one is tube. Triangle prism. Square based pyramid. Square And 
guess this shape? It's cone. Hemisphere. And the last one is octahedron. If you like this episode, let us know in comments down below. Solar system facts. Hi kids! Let's talk about solar system facts. Our solar system consists of eight planets which all orbit around our home star, the Sun. The solar system was formed a crazy 4 and 6 billion years ago. It consists of eight planets which are Mercury, Venus, Earth, and Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, Neptune. Mercury. The closest planet to the Sun is only about as wide as the Atlantic Ocean. 18 Mercuries would fit into the Earth. The planet does not have an atmosphere, just like it is on all other planets. This is also the fastest planet. It speeds with pace with 31 miles per second. Venus. Venus named after the Roman goddess of beauty. Yellow clouds made of sulfur and sulfuric acid cover the entire planet causing light to reflect off the surface. This makes Venus the second brightest object in the sky after the moon. The surface of Venus hosts thousands of volcanoes, craters, super high mountain ranges. Earth Earth is the fifth largest planet of our solar system and has one large natural satellite, the moon. All planets were named after Roman and Greek gods and goddesses except the Earth. The name nevertheless is more than 1000 years old and means just ground. Everything one ever known is here, the only place where life is known to currently exist. About 70% of the Earth's surface is water covered. Mars Mars, the most likely candidate for a future human habitat, has huge storms that occur every now and then and cover the entire planet. Mars is very cold and dry, but water exists in form of ice at the north and south poles. The surface of Mars has many craters, deep valleys and volcanoes. Mars has two moons called Phobos and Deimos. Both are probably asteroids which were caught up by Mars' gravitational field. Jupiter Jupiter is the largest planet in solar system. The most famous feature on the surface of the planet is the Great Red Spot, which is actually a storm that has been blowing for about 350 years, if not longer. Saturn Saturn is a gas giant just like Jupiter, Neptune and Uranus. This means that it doesn't really have a proper solid surface, as it is mainly made up of gases with a small rocky core. Saturn is the second largest planet and is known for its rings. Although the other gas giants also have this kind of rings, only Saturn's rings can be seen the clearest. Uranus Uranus is the second furthest planet from the Sun and therefore also has to travel a pretty long time to go once around our home star. It takes Uranus roughly 48 years to orbit once around the Sun. Uranus is a blue planet not because of water, but because of gases that make it appear blue. Uranus orbits on its side, which means that its seasons are completely different to ours. Summer and winter each take 21 years at the North and South Poles. Neptune Neptune is closely related to Uranus. The atmosphere is composed of almost the same gases and just like Uranus, Neptune also appears blue. Neptune inherits its name from the Roman god of the sea, as reference to its deep blue color. Neptune is the furthest planet from the Sun, and it takes 165 years for Neptune to go once around the Sun. It was me, Aria, with you today.
If you enjoyed this episode, don't forget to like it. Facts about physics Hello, my friends! I am a big fan of physics and I would like you to find the science fun as I did. So here are some entertaining facts about physics. Number 1. Objects with mass are attracted to each other. This is known as gravity. Number 2. A 200 pound person would only weigh 76 pounds on Mars because of differences in gravity. Number 3. Light from the Earth takes just 1.255 seconds to reach the Moon. Number 4. A magnifying glass uses the properties of a convex shaped lens to magnify an image, making it easier to see. Number 5. Dogs can hear sound at a higher frequency than humans, allowing them to hear noises that we can't. Number 6. The speed of sound is around 767 miles per hour. Number 7. When traveling through water, sound moves around 4 times faster than when it travels through air. Number 8. Water is wet in the sense of being a liquid which flows easily because its viscosity is low, which is because its molecules are rather loosely joined together. Number 9. If one day you find yourself in space, please do not bring a pen with you, because you will not be able to write anything with it. Fun fact, pens that we use on Earth just don't work in space because there is no gravity and the ink can come out of the pen. Luckily, pencils would work in space due to the black graphite they are made of. Number 10. Lightning bolts can travel at around 130,000 miles per hour while reaching nearly 30,000 degrees in temperature. Which of facts are your favorite? Let us know in comments down below. Please give us like so we can do more videos for you. Thank you for watching. See you soon. The top 5 highest mountains in the world. Hi kids! Let's find out new things about mountains. A mountain is a geological landform that rises about the surrounding land. Mountain climbing is an extremely popular pastime. Mountains make the world more beautiful and interesting. I'm going to tell you the top 5 highest mountains in the world. Mount Everest Everest is situated on the border between Nepal and autonomous region of Tibet. Everest is the world's highest mountain. Its peak is an eye-watering 8,848 meters above sea level, making it well over 8 times taller than the highest mountain in Wales. Everest is a part of seven summits. The seven summit is a list made up of the highest mountain on each of the world's seven continents. Climbing all seven of the seven summits is one of the ultimate achievements in a sport of mountaineering. K2 K2, also known officially as Mount Goodwin Austin, has a summit 8,611 meters above sea level and it has the second highest rate of any mountain with a height over 8,000 meters. It is located on the border between China and Pakistan. The Chinese side of the mountain is widely considered to be the more difficult and hazardous side, so the summit is usually attempted from the Pakistan side. Kanchenjunga Kanchenjunga is the third highest mountain in the world. It sits on the border between Nepal and India and has an elevation of 8,586 meters. There is tradition when ascending Kanchenjunga to stop just short of the summit. This dates back to the first successful climb on the mountain. Every climber since then has followed the respectful example set by the first ascent. Lhotse Lhotse Elevation 8,516 meters is the fourth highest mountain in the world. 
It neighbors Mount Everest and forms part of the Everest Massif. The summit of Lhotse is on the border between the Kubu region of Nepal and Tibet. This mountain is widely considered to be the most difficult climb over 8,000 meters in the world. Makalu with an elevation of 8,485 meters, Makalu is officially the fifth highest mountain in the world. Situated 19 kilometers southeast of Everest, on the border between Nepal and China, Makalu is notable for its summit icon pyramid shape. This mountain has isolated position, which leaves it exposed to the elements, and numerous knife-edge ridges and fan-filling steep sections. The latter stages of the accent, in particular, involve some extremely technical rock and ice climbing. Thank you for watching! If you found our episode useful, let us know in comments down below!